You still need to decide which one you want to do. The shells or the uh, regular elbow. Well, I mean, I had asked for the shells, and then I said shells originally. Why? Is this one is more harder than the other? Mm -hmm. um, I actually didn't have it. He ain't had the shells in so long. Why was you about to say it? Eddie, you don't know if there's a lot in there, huh? No, it's good. It's good. Okay, I got my salt. What did I just pour it in there? Yep, just sprinkle it on there. Oh my god. Okay, you good. <laughs> Take and make a mixture, yeah, and then pour it up there. But yeah. we're gonna take it and put it all on the back of cheese. Yeah. Goodness, what we got going on here? All right, so what is this? What is this? Good Lord, what is it? Mozzarella, Mozzarella sharp cheddar, Kobe Jack. Yeah. Uh, just original, yeah, original Velveeta. This is a tad bit of oil. And my macaroni cheese, so it won't stick. What is it vegetable? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't matter. Just oil, and I put in there, mm -hmm. so it won't. When I drain it, it won't be, you know, sticky, super yeah. sticky. Sticky, sticky. 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 Oh, I hate that. Is that just pour in there? You got constant um, stir? Yep. Not constant, constant, but just watch this. Your bowl. Okay, we're going to um, put the cheese in there. Okay. <laughs> just watch it, you know, give it a little toss. Girl. Because you, your thing is you don't want it to stick. You know, if you do any type of pasta or noodles or anything like that, yeah, you're just trying to, you're just saying, you're saying monitor it. I'm just being funny. <laughs> oh my gosh, what a fun time. Ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just love, uh, just 
love of cooking mac and cheese. Mm -hmm. uh, you love eating it though, I bet you. But I need the exact measurements. No, that's just like when I do my curry chicken. But I won't. Nobody can't. It's like I can't tell you guys. I go by taste. Oh my god. No, like, they they gonna think you gatekeeping. <laughs> Are you gatekeeping the recipe? Yeah. They kind of don't bake mac and cheese. Most places don't bake mac and oh. cheese. Most places. That's why it's nice when you can find a place that actually like do a nice baked mac and cheese because they usually yeah. all taste like. You know, no disrespect to them, but like crab, like, you know, like <laughs> crab mac and cheese. People not go out. Nah, people not order it that way. Mm -hmm. Well, mac and cheese, you know, between me and Lil, but you know. Well, yeah, no, that's a hard, you know, it's a hard <laughs> act to follow. Like you can't go out and get that. Like I have had some good catered mac and cheese though, but it's because yeah. they baked it. Somebody, like, they, somebody that's, cooked. Yeah, baked that's it. just like at Ricky's party. And I was like, uh uh. It was mac and cheese? Yes, Lord. It was fire. I was like, who? We ain't bringing that. Mac and cheese right here. And then it had the nerve to be one of the yellow girls. Okay. She said, that was my niece. I said, can I please get that recipe? She said, she please. Was, what I she mean, did? it was flavor all up in there. I'm talking flavor, not no flavor. <laughs> flavor. <laughs> and another thing, too, you can tell by when a noodle, mm -hmm. you see the darkness right here. Mm -hmm. It still need to be cooked. Most oh, when it's darker. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know how people run a res uh, restaurant. Like, oh my god. Well, you see how them chefs and stuff be, you know, I, they off the chain. Like, you know what I get? I don't like nobody in my kitchen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like dog coming in. And it's like, okay, you need to be like, wait. <laughs> ain't no making no cakes, and I'm in the middle of my. <laughs> you got to go. <laughs> Scared me. You just did pull it out of hot pot and water. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave it there then for a little while. <laughs> the texture you feel okay? You need, need a little bit more. Oh no, she eating a new one. She ain't eating oh, all day. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Kay, come on now. You want to pump it? Oh my gosh, I'm scared. I'm just gonna pour it out. Hey y'all, so right here we're just adding all of the cheeses in the half and half. I just had to pause and let you guys know what was going on. And also, if you're enjoying yourself, go ahead and like and subscribe. I hope you're having as much fun as I did making this. This was such a memorable moment with mom. Uh, I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Okay, thank you. Flavor, salt. Okay, salt up there. Okay. Nice and salty. Yep. Okay. Y'all type. Mm -hmm. Stir, right? Pepper. Okay, get the peppers on in there. Okay. Get the peppers in there. And then you stir uh, onion powder. Nice, nice. Okay. And stir? Yep, stir it all in. Let's make sure the butt is done now. It's good Break it or no? Break it. You gotta get a little muscle in there. I can get muscle in it. Yeah, come on. So you gotta get all over here so you got cheese and start them out. Mm -hmm. You gotta make it blend in there. Mm -hmm. Make sure all these things put some in the middle. Why is that worse? No, they're gonna get inside the cheese. The cheese gonna get, get in, in it. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, that's why I chose it. Mm -hmm. That's what you used to make it with. 
the shells. Mm -hmm. This is all about making sure all the stuff that we put in there get a nice mixture with the cheese and cream. Mm -hmm. How long do you put it in? You're gonna do about 25 minutes. Cause then we're gonna put um another 10, we're gonna put in, do another 10 minutes so I can put the top the cheese on. Another 10 minutes? Yeah. Ooh, baby. Look at you. Look at them edges. Ooh, look at them edges, baby. <laughs> Dang. Now that's some mac and cheese, girl. <laughs> they don't know nothing about that. That's some mac and cheese. That's a wrap. Thank you, mommy. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 